So, this week is Valentine's Day, and guess what? It's on a Tuesday. So you are probably coming off of work to go to dinner. My son is crying in the background because he doesn't want to take a nap. So thankfully, I've already taped this eye tutorial and I'm going to just edit it in after this little message. But basically, all you need to know is all of these products are from the drugstore. It's an NYX eye pencil, a Lash Blast, Lash Blast Cover Girl Mascara, liquid eyeliner, and that's all you need to do this smoky eye look. So I hope you enjoy it and I hope you get some tips and tricks to help your Valentine's Day be a one to remember. All right, the first step in getting that smoky blended look on your eyes is I'd like to take a jumbo eye pencil NYX. I have a white one which is called my do it all and this really helps me with smoky eyes. It's one and it's in the color black bean. And so what I do is I have some makeup on today, but I'm just going to take, it's like a day look that can go to a night look, just with a pencil, some liner, and some mascara. Um, so let's say you have your foundation on and you're moving on to your eyes. So what I do is I take this and I just kind of draw, I know it looks really, um, not good, but I promise you're just going to put it all on here because the key to all of this is the blending. So I'm putting it all here. And the higher you go, the, the deeper the smoky eye is going to look. So I'm just going to start off there. It's pretty simple. You're going to love it. So I put the pencil aside. You're going to get out a brush, um, a blended, a blender brush. This is the one that I use. It's real thick and fluffy. Or if you have a, a brush like this that is more stiff, this is going to give you a more concentrated look. Um, you could, if you have smaller eyes, you could use something like this, and this would kind of get in that smaller eye space that you have. Uh, but for me, I'm going to start off right here, and we're going to blend. So we're going to take it, and in small circles, just blend into that outer corner. And I, and I like how nicely it. It just blends for me. So if you're kind of in a a rush and you want to take a day look to a night look but you don't have a whole lot of time to do it. So let's say, hello, Valentine's Day is on a Tuesday. How many of you are working? Me. And you have your everyday work makeup and then you want to go to a night thing. Go home and just get that jumbo eye pencil and just put a little on there and then you look like you are ready for a night out on the town with your significant other or if you know what you're single you go out with the ladies so you're taking it there and blending blending and all I'm doing is just small little circles and I'm blending it up okay if you were to have um, this pencil you could kind of do it more at an angle and give yourself kind of a lifted look up here if you do it more on an angle like that and then kind of brush it down like a flat side like that. You can do that also. The smaller brush, um, there is also a lot of people who have been telling me I have a ton of brushes but I don't know what to use them for. Well if you have a smaller brush like this, same thing. It's just that you're gonna, the smaller brush just helps you get kind of more of that area right there increased it in. So now we have that kind of smoky look on that outer corner and so we're going to do the other side really quick and what I did again is you just kind of dot it on and I know it looks really bad but do you see how easily it comes off? That's what is awesome about this pencil I'm telling you. These jumbo pencils are great. You take your fluffy brush again and just circles to get that smoky look. So I'm going to show you with a different one just in case you don't have a pencil like that. Let's say it's more like that. Same thing. This is more like you're bringing out the color. And and the key thing to a smoky look is blending. Do you see how right there it, it still looks a little too harsh? You want to keep blending that part out. You don't, you want to just have a nice 
seamless, gradual look. You don't want to ever see where um, it kind of starts. And then you can kind of take it like that and just keep clicking. This is a great look, I think, for going out um, because you can make your eyes really dramatic, but then you can keep your lip more of a nude lip. So we have that. And so it's a nice smoky look. Then you can take it down under here. If you want to bring it all the way down for the smoky look to go all the way down. Uh, now remember, if you bring it down and you connect it, kind of like I'm doing, it's going to give you a more closed look. But the smoky look is what you're kind of aiming for anyway. So, All right. Then I take um, my large flat pencil, and you could take this and, and get a, a more a gray look, and you can put it on top of it like that. You can take a color that matches your eyelid and put it over like this. If you've made a mistake and you're freaking out because you've put too much of the jumbo pencil, to really make it um, erase any mistakes, you can take your concealer, you can take your foundation, or you can take an eyeshadow that's the same color of your eyelid, and just go over where you made a mistake. If it's too far out over here, take that eye um, shadow and just bring it up that way and go in an angle so it's kind of not going out too far. That's what I do. Um, then I take my liner and I go over what I just did. And this is how we get kind of that swooped. I start there, kind of already up, winged at the tip, and I just bring it down. And because you've already done the smoky look to it, you don't have to do too much. Because it's already kind of a dark look. Same thing on the other side, start there, go down. And the angle of the brush when you do it that way already instantly gives you kind of that winged look. And you can make it as thick as you want it to. Then if you feel like you've missed some spots, you can go over with just a liner. Can you tell I need a new eyeliner? How embarrassing. But you know what? I know I'm not the only woman out there with an eyeliner that it's this big, okay? I know all of you out there has one that's this big. Um, so you go over and you just fill in what you missed. And if you have spots like that right there, you can go back and we'll just kind of smudge it in. And you can take a brush like this to kind of do that. There we go. And so we can bring it down even more if we want to here. that. And then of course you take your mascara. This is the CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume. It's my favorite. I already have some on from earlier this morning. And it just takes it to pump it up. So there you go. You have the nice smoky look. Um, I like it because you can go from day to night like that 
Again, it's the NYX pencil in black bean. Um, if you're if you're not into maybe a very dark smoky look, maybe this is too dark for you. You can do a brown smoky look. It doesn't always have to be black. Uh, but the key thing is is that you can make it go a lot faster with a jumbo pencil, just dotting it on. It has to be real creamy, so it's really easy to blend. That's what I do, and I really like it. And I hope you try it out maybe for Tuesday for this Valentine's Day. Uh, when you get off of work, you can go out with your sweetheart or like I said, go out with the single ladies, wherever you want to go. Um, I hope you have a great Valentine's Day. I hope you have a great week. Please tune in continually. Subscribe, follow me, Leslie Owen, or on Facebook um, because I'm really trying to get more of these out there. And I really would like to help you with just some tips and tricks that I've been sharing. So... Have a great day, God bless you, and have a great Valentine's Day.